Hi, I'm Steve Weierman. I'm a math and computer science educator based in New York City. For more information about me and my business, please visit me on the web at iteran.com. What I want to talk about today is how to systematically count things. Uh, in this case, I'm going to take as an example this uh, very uh, recently popular uh, count the squares problem. You probably have seen this floating around on uh, Facebook. Uh, so the question is, how many squares are here? Now, I didn't draw this very well, but assume this is symmetrical and uh, all these rectangles are really squares. So let's count them systematically. Let's start with the smallest squares and work our way up from there. So we've got these really small squares in the center here. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And that's all of the small squares we have. So we've got eight small squares. Let's now count the slightly bigger squares. So the squares that are this size. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, 15, 16. But we also have 17, that's also a square, and 18. So we've got 18 of these single squares like that. But we've got even bigger squares. We've got squares that are comprised of four of these smaller squares. So we've got one, Two, three, and then we move down one row, four, five, six, and then move down to the last row, seven, eight, nine. So we've got nine of those two by two squares. What about three by three squares? Well, we've got one right there. We've got two. Move down one row. Three and four. And that's all of the three by three squares. So we only have four of those. And then finally, this whole thing here is one big square. So 18 plus 8, that's 26, plus 9, that's 35, plus 4, that's 39, plus 1, that's 40. So the correct answer to that problem is there are 40 squares. And if you looked at the comments on a lot of those threads on Facebook, most people got up to 40, somewhere in the 30s, but no one got past 40. Uh, and a few people actually got the correct answer of 40 squares. So if you're wondering, that's how you count squares. That's an example of systematic counting. Uh, we'll do more examples uh, in later videos. I hope you found this useful. Again, please check out my website.